In this video, we'll go through how you're defining the modules in the PI system. What are the the, the modules, or how you can configure it? So, uh, in this instance, we have uh, created a, a bucket. Uh, we have added the module uh, as the PI archiving module, and we have defined a module key for this. Then we create a parameter called bucket and we put the bucket value there, uh, the value of the file bucket that we've just created. Then we are creating the parser that we want to def use for this one. In this instance, we are using the de facto parser that parses the document using the de facto uh, parser. Uh, so that's how. It's really easy to, to get started using the artifact mapping. And if we want to use the XML uh, XPath mapper, we can see that we have selected the path as XPath, and then we have the, the namespace, uh, and we have the XPath. Uh, we have the XPath, which just defines this is the prefix of all the XPath that we want, so we can pass through the list and find all the, the values there. And then we have the name of the the attribute we want to save uh, these information with. And then we put in the XPath. Notice that we're also using the namespace declaration for this. And we have the namespace declaration uh, defined the same way with namespace dot the namespace name. And then we have the, the value of this namespace. So that this how simple it is to configure these two